Uh, greetings all and welcome back to Globix Gaming Channel. Um, we've hit a bit of a milestone. Uh, I've just, well not at this precise moment, a couple of days back, I think it was on Sunday, um, I reached my 1,000th subscriber. Um, I don't know what to say really. I never thought in my wildest, in, wildest dreams that uh, the channel would ever get to 1,000 subscribers. Um, to be honest with you, I did this as a part of a bit of an experiment to see um, if it would actually take off, and it actually has. It's even got to the stage now where I'm getting money for ads and things on the channel, which is absolutely amazing, and partnered um, with some sort of advertising company thing. I'm not sure how it works, but basically you get adverts to start the video, and I get like a couple of pennies every time you watch something. It's fantastic. Uh, what this has allowed me to do, I promised I would do it, um, my 1,000 subscriber competition. Now, what it's going to be, okay, I'm going to do a replay competition. All right, it has to be a World of Tanks replay, obviously. Um, and what I'm going to do is the best replay that I get between now, the 1st of July, and the last day in July. I think it's the 31st, but whatever the last day in July is, the competition will close on the last day in July. The best replay um, that I get submitted to me, all right, will win a prize. All right. Um, it can be any vehicle um, with only one restriction. The maximum tier is tier eight. All right, tier eight only. Okay, you can do tier one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You're not allowed to use tier nine and ten vehicles. Now, the reason I'm doing this before you all start shouting, "Oh, Glump, I want to show you my waffle tractor." Um, a lot of the people that watch my channel, including a lot of my clan mates, they don't have tier ten and tier nine tanks. And the thing with those kind of games is. Um, you get things like waffle tractors and they're just fucking broken and death stars and shit like that I've got no interest in seeing overpowered tanks just dominating games what I want to see is gameplay um, tier 8 is the maximum tier limit um, what this will allow you to do if you're in a tier 8 tank you can get into tier 10 games uh, and absolutely reap a harvest if you play really well um, but I'll leave that up to you guys now the base experience what I'll do is I'll just jump in a battle in the good old TOG uh, the reason I'm doing this is this is probably the prize you're going to win, guys. Um, just a little bit of a space, a completely live game. You're going to be in a TOG 2. And this is one of the reasons why I'm buying or going to get you a TOG 2. You get it in the gift shop, you get a TOG, and you, the only thing you don't get is crew. I'm just going to pop into the chat. And watch this. Now, I put it's TOG time in the TOG chat. This is TOG chat now in the team chat. Watch what happens. I bet you I get a response. You always get a response. Everybody has fun when you play TOG. There you go. <laughs> TOG's going to get Right, so basically you're going to win one of these. Now, what the reason I wanted to cap it at tier 8, like I said, is because of waffle tractors and things like that. But also, don't be afraid to submit your dinky tanks. Um, I'm going to base it mostly loosely on base experience, but if you have an absolutely amazing game, you may get a special prize. <laughs> or the mothership. There you go. And this is one of the reasons why I want people to buy TOG. TOG is amazing. TOG is epic. Um, what are the plans? Well, what I'm going to do is well, I'm going to hold a little in-game competition as well. We're going to do the replay competition that finishes on the end of July. At the end of July, I'm going to be running some live events. What we're going to do is we're going to have a little, basically, hunt the Tier 1 game. Basically, what's going to happen is myself and a couple of the guys from the clan um, are basically going to get in Panzer 1Cs or something suitably quick and you're all going to be in T1 Cunninghams. All those who want to take part you need to buy a T1 Cunningham. Okay. What we'll do is we'll basically go on a map like similar to this one uh, or maybe even Wide Park and we're basically going to hunt you down. Last man standing wins a prize. So you basically get 30 seconds to a minute at the start of the game to go and hide somewhere and me and a couple of other guys have to come and hunt you down in Panzer 1C. Now, the criteria is you're not allowed to shoot at us. Uh, it's last man standing. Now, if we get a big influx of players, there'll be a league system which will be handled by Phoenix or Q. Um, they don't know it yet, but it will. <laughs> um, and basically, we'll see what happens there. Basically, what we've got is a lot of the guys went to Tank Fest this year, which I didn't get a chance to go to because I was obviously grading. Uh, I'm now, by the way, just for those of you interested, a first down in Wadaru Karate. <laughs> I passed on Sunday, which was awesome. Uh, one of the hardest days of my life and I've also now no longer have feeling in my calves um, I'm sat here basically um, high on codeine phosphate um, thanks to my sponsors from codeine phosphate and Lucas 8 Sport 
um, trying to get the electrolytes back in my system. It's now the Tuesday. Uh, my awards presentation is tonight. Which is going to be absolutely amazing. Now, Tog has finally made it into town. And Tog is about to feast. To feast on tier 6 tanks. Um, so, yeah, the Panzer 1C competition is going to be pretty good. We've done it before. Um, with Not with real money prizes, but we did it with uh, giggle prizes. Which was interesting. Let's peek around this corner. Have a bit of a look. See what we can see. I'm getting hit from something. What am I getting hit by? Air or 44. Okay. Let's side scrape then. Side scraping in a tog. But yeah. Um, so we'll get the competition running. If those that you're interested in it, get yourself a Tier 1 Cunningham. You can have any setup you want. The only thing you're not allowed to do is you are not allowed to fire at the Panzer 1Cs. So no loading premium and all that kind of good stuff. I'm going to cover this side for these guys because they're going that way. Um, yeah. And we'll see what happens from there. So more to come from the channel. A uh, thousand subscribers. I got a big influx of subscribers as well uh, a couple of days ago. I don't know what that was for. Um, I don't know if somebody watched and saw one of my videos. I'm not sure. Um, but I got about 20 subscribers in quick succession, which was amazing. Um, this guy doesn't understand Tog. He doesn't understand how to fight Tog. You don't get into a shooting match with a Tog. See? It's a KV1S, ladies and gentlemen. Backing off from a Tog. DPM to work. Is that guy reverse side scraping? Really? I'm gonna chase him. You can get chased down in a tog, bro. Top feasts on KV1S. Oh no! But I don't care because I've got 1400 hit points. Thank you. GG, thanks for coming. Ooh, got somebody behind me. Sorry, I go very quiet when I'm playing, guys. I do apologize. I hide behind this P1S, hopefully. <laughs> oh no, RL! <laughs> Boom. Yep, that's the tank you're going to win, guys. Um, if you're interested in doing it, get your replay sent in as quickly as possible. Just the reason I wanted to do this game is I'm going to let it run its course. I'm going to go back to the garage. I'm basically going to show you what I mean by base experience. Yep, so we're going to do a Panzer 1C competition with Tier 1 or any Tier 1 tank that you like. And we're also going to replay competition. Replay is based on base experience and base experience alone, with a maximum tier cap of 8. That doesn't mean you can only send tier 8 replays in. Okay, you can send any tier you want. It's the maximum base experience. What you want to try and do as a strategy is you want to get in a tank that can handle itself and punch above its weight. For example, T29. Um, because basically getting tier 9 games, you get it in the right position, it's badass. Yep. Or your tier 8s, concentrate on those. You've got a month to do it. What I want you to do, all right, is title your replay. Okay, when you send it to me at uh, globit1683 at gmail.com, is I want to know it's a World of Tanks competition. Okay, so put competition replay, the name of the tank, and the base experience in the title of the email. I get shitloads of emails um, from people. So if you want to be a part of the replay competition, put replay competition, the name of your tank, okay, and the base experience. Or so what I mean by the base experience, which is perfectly timed, um, that was actually a WN8 of uh, 3,835 there. I wasn't even fucking trying. Um, now, that's not your base experience. The 2,862 is not your base experience, okay? Your base experience is this number here. Okay, my base experience for that mission was 954. Okay, which isn't bad. I'm actually quite impressed with that. I wasn't expecting that to go as well as it did, to be perfectly honest with you, but there you go. Um, it doesn't include times twos and it doesn't include the bonuses for premium account. It's only your base experience. Okay, hopefully I've hammered that home enough. It's your base experience I'm going to, I'm going to base the actual re results on. So the person with the highest base experience. Now, if there's something that's quite close and I think one person's got exceptional, my decision is final. Okay, it's me giving my money away, so it's my decision to final. There will be no bias with regards to my clan. Like, it's open to my clan, it's open to everyone. Yes, yeah, so pass it on to your friends, but they have to title it. Get them to watch this video and title the thing. Replay competition, 
name of the tank and the base experience in the email title okay I'm expecting quite a few emails okay and I don't want to read them all um, the minimum the minimum base experience will be a thousand okay the minimum base experience you have to do better than that tog game basically you have to get better than a thousand otherwise I'll just put it in a bin somewhere unless you can put, put something in the description that makes it sound absolutely amazing all right I've only got I haven't got a secret camera minion like Jingles has to you know I've got Eddie to go and like you know um, watch all the replays so I'm going to have to do it for myself and details for the Panzer 1C competition will be to follow in another video all right so I'm not dead guys I have been absent okay over the last few days which is one of the guys nanocrafters think has commented on my FV 304 video saying are you dead no, I'm not dead. I'm back, but I've had a lot of things on my plate. I'm now free. Okay, I've passed my tank grade. I've got nothing actually on in the future. I may um, even start streaming soon, but I've got to speak to uh, Two Free Alpha. I've got to speak to the wife about that. But details to follow. So, if you're interested in the replay competition, guys, get your emails sent in. Um, Panzer One C competition details to follow, and you may win one of these bad boys. You may win yourself a top two. I'll catch you later, guys. Thanks to all those that have stuck with me and have stuck around. There's a thousand of you now, and it's absolutely freakish to know, knowing that a thousand people, you know, subscribe to my channel because they want to listen to me rant on about World of Tanks. But it's absolutely flattering, guys. Um, I'm glad you're enjoying the content, and I'll see you next time. Bye now.